Hi, welcome to QBase 4 tutorial. My name is Mickey. This time I'm going to show you how to use your Apple remote. Well, for all your Mac users who have actually the recent models that came with Apple remote, um, guess what? You can use it as a remote uh, control device in QBase 4. So it's very simple to set it. Go to Devices, Device Setup, and under Remote Controls, press plus Apple remote control is the first option and hit OK and that would be it now the trick is that or the good side of all of this is that we can actually set almost anything we like by default some shuttle play functions are set I actually changed the menu for example the quick press of menu to be record enable the long press menu I was I said to be record and as you can see here if you can actually find a function in Cubase 4 well that function can be added to your Apple remote uh, next thing I said was a play a long press to be returned to zero you have difference here between quick presses and long presses hit apply and that would be it so I'm gonna add audio track to show you that it works. I'm going to add marker track and quickly set some markers here. So, so we can see different functionalities. So, okay. Quick presses on the rewind and forward would go through the markers the long presses would actually scroll the plus and minus will actually scrub if we need to which is really cool again play quick press is play another quick press is stop it's it's basically using the space bar replacement if i select the audio and do the quick press of menu I set that to be record enable. I can actually go through my markers, set it where it needs to go, and do the long press on menu, and it's going to start recording. All right, excellent. Obviously, a long press on menu stops recording. the The playback still goes on, so you can actually use this as a as a in and out function. Uh, what else we have? The long press on play. I said to be return zero. So pretty much you can play with with all the functions and see what you prefer. But if you're sitting away from the computer and you want to actually have a remote control with your Mac, Apple remote, that's available in Cubase 4. Uh, that will be all for today. I'll see you with the next training course.